Hey guys, welcome back to Bear Fruit Style. This is Megan, your host. Um, so today, I don't know if you guys notice anything different about my surroundings. Um, yes, I still look a hot mess, but I don't think that's ever gonna change. Um, I am in my new house and I am in my beauty room. I'm gonna show that later. So this is my very first get ready with me in my new home. I'm so excited. So yes, I am engaged to be married to my amazing fiance, Noe. Some of you guys know him. Some of you guys will get to know him. We are gonna be doing some podcasts and some collaborations in the future. So be on the lookout for that. Um, other than that, this is my beautiful ring. He did such a great job. I love him. He did this all by himself and the proposal was gorgeous. I cried my face off, it was amazing. Okay, so I am going to be choosing between these two wigs today. So I'm gonna do my beat afterward very quickly. But the first thing I wanna do, whoa, I just made a spit bubble. The first thing I wanna do is put a wig on. So I'm gonna uh, put my hair in the low bun, not this, this is spooky. Low bun, nice and tight. Put the wig cap on, get that together, and then we're gonna pick one. So I put a poll out uh, today on social media and I have between this one and this one. So I'm not too sure yet, I have not checked the stats. So I'm gonna give it a few minutes and then we're gonna come back to that. So I think first things first, we're gonna go ahead and just put this wig cap on. Um, and by that time that I'm finished, then we'll go ahead and see what the results are. So far, I have a tie between both the pink and the honey, so we'll see what happens. Okay, now it feels good, but I think I wanna do it just a little bit longer. Let me, I'm gonna spray a little bit more. Watch, this thing is not gonna come off, okay? But that's what I need though, right? Am I right? Am I right? Here we go. I think I'm ready. Looks good. This is actually a lot of pressure on my eyes and it really hurts. <laughs> okay, here we go. Actually, I think. Ooh, it made a huge hole. <laughs> it's because my cranium is large. Here we go. Release the tension. Whew, that was a lot of pressure. Okay. I'm gonna switch scissors. These are my hair scissors. Okay. All right, hopefully I don't take off my whole front end. Now, of course we know being Mexican, 
I got lots of hair right here. So it's not going to adhere all the way down here because I got a little bit of a sideburn. Let's, let's be real. Let's acknowledge the fur. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to kind of get the edges as much as I can. getting there getting there getting there I'm gonna peel up a little bit like roll just a little bit more not too much though but enough to kind of even out my line my hairline and then I'm going to snip snip I think that's good for now that's good nobody wants a five head right a five head okay okay so now what I'm gonna go ahead and do is I am going to use my got to be glued gel and I'm going to try to melt the edges, okay? So I'm gonna use my glue and I'm gonna use a rat tail comb, okay? So what I usually try to do, I'm trying to mix it up a little bit. Since I've been moving, a lot of stuff has just kind of been sitting in boxes for a minute, so. My precious items have not been in use. So let's go ahead and put some here. It's kind of a lot. It is a lot. But I'm going to try to spread it out. Spread it, spread it. Y'all, okay. So I live in Baytown now. And, you know, in Houston, there are beauty shops everywhere. Beauty, um, you know, um, beauty supplies everywhere and of course they sell hair and stuff for you know usually you know about 40 something dollars and of course you know i feel like it's a lot of, it's pretty affordable anyway check this out look at that you just smooth it down and of course i'll get rid of the excess later but look at that oh my god Wow, sorry, squirrel. That is legit. Okay, so I just had to show y'all that. Anyway, y'all, I go to one of the beauty supply stores over here. A synthetic wig. A synthetic wig with barely a closure, barely a busted closure. $100. I was like, I mean, is human hair in it? Like, is it a mix? Girl, no. But it's because there's no competition. B-Town. Oh, I was like, oh, no. I'm shopping in Houston. Fudge this. It, and the hair wasn't even that good. Like, none of the stuff really caught my eye. And they were like, well, uh, I was like, do y'all have any, like, fun colors and stuff like that? And they were just like um well we have this pink one and it was like ugly busted dusty i was like mm, no thank you and i told him i said i said wow i usually buy hair all the time and i have never i said the most i've spent on a synthetic wig from a beauty supply store even online at glamour Tress or diva Tress. They're like 40 bucks, 30 bucks, 20 something on a good day. I was like, y'all are tripping. But there's not many out here, so I don't mind making the drive. It's but anyway, that is the story I have to tell you. Look at that. That is not half bad. Not Okay. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and go over this line with um, with the blow dryer, and uh, yeah, we're gonna see what happens. <laughs> or you know what? Let me check the poles for the wig. And let's see, give me just a second. It's literally a tie. It is four votes for pink and two.
two votes on Instagram for the honey and two votes on, on Facebook for honey. I just need a tiebreaker. I just need one more vote. Oh, well, y'all, I look bald. I look like, mm, that means I did a good job. Jesus, take the wheel. Mm, the price of beauty. <laughs> I'll get better at this, I swear. All right, y'all, the results are in. And the winner is the pink wig. Okay, I'm wearing the pink wig. I already did my eyebrows. I'm not gonna do the top until I go ahead and do my makeup and put the wig on and secure that bad boy. So right now, this is what she's looking like. She's a little crusty, but that she's crusty because of me. I did that. Instead of putting just powder, I put a little bit of liquid and I shouldn't have done that. Like it was creamy. So I put it on my wrist and I kind of dabbed it with my thing and I went and I was like, oh snaps, it's crusty. Anyway, we're gonna just do our best up in here and uh, here we go. So here is the pink wig. She is long, very pretty. I actually found her on uh, Amazon. She was very inexpensive. I can't remember exactly how much she was, but um, I know she was not expensive. And the only reason I purchased her from Amazon, because I don't buy wigs from Amazon, is because of the reviews. Um, now what I'm gonna do today as well is I'm gonna be wearing a hat. So I'm not gonna be too worried about the, um, you know, the hairline. Um, of course, I am going to share that with you guys, but as far as being freaked out about what's this, you know, what's it gonna look like when people see it, you know, not really a big deal. So anyway, this is what she looks like. That is her part. I think it looks okay. Thing looks good. You can see my nails right through it. Of course, it comes with combs. Now, there's really no need for combs, really. Um, people do it, or the makers of these wigs do it if you want to go glueless. But honestly, you can you can just take them off if you want to. They're not. There's only like one stitch that is keeping them on. So let's go ahead and try it on really quick. And then uh, we will secure this bad boy. Now, she is a little bit, she's not as straight as I would like her to be, but it's because she has been moving. We've been moving. So that's why she's a little busted. But that's okay. And... So this is what she looks like. You know, not bad for the hairline. Not shabby at all. At all. Okay, so I actually like her. I think she looks really cute. Um, I am gonna be wearing black tonight, uh, but I need to hurry up because it is 7.07. Okay, okay. All right, so what I'm gonna do, what I'm gonna do, first of all, she's shedding a ton. So, dang. <laughs> okay, look at this. Jeez. I mean, synthetic hair sheds anyway, but my goodness. Uh, okay, all right. I'm gonna snip some of this. This is just excessive. I also collect it, collect before the hairs actually shed onto the floor. I like to just uh, grab them and um, keep them on the table and then throw them away because I don't like feeling hair between my toes. That's like a weird peeve of mine. Okay. And now I'm gonna get my uh, Moco de Gorilla. Actually, my uh, Got To Be Glued. I'm gonna do the exact same thing I did earlier. I'm gonna put it here on the tip. 
okay a little goes a long way so this is gonna go all the way across so right on the line is it wow it also has little baby hairs cute okay you can kind of see through the lace but which i mean technically is a good thing but that just means that you know, I gotta do a better job. Okay, okay, uh, that's not cute. And I gotta be careful, because again, I have a lot of hair. So I want to kind of steer clear of cutting my hair. When I lay it down, it's like it disappears. What the, look at that. Oh my God, I don't know why I'm dripping. It's like it now, the only thing I'm a little bit nervous about is when I start to put my foundation and stuff, and stuff, that's when I'm gonna be like, mm. okay. So I'm gonna go ahead, do my makeup, wrap this up, and uh, I'll be back in just a minute. All right, you guys, this is the final look. I absolutely love it. There is a bit of a untangle, but oh my God, look at that do. That is not freaking half bad. Now, the only thing, of course, we know is noticeable is my, my part here is, you know, it ain't natural looking, but girl, this is cute. Mm. Oh, girl, this is cute. I am feeling it. Hmm, I need to just cut this. Anyway, tell me what y'all think. Do we like it? Do we not? Mm. I'm feeling it. Feeling it. Feeling it. Oh my God. So anyway, I am super late. Church has already started. Worship is probably already over, but I'm dedicated, okay, you guys? So anyway, my review for this sucker, not that this is technically a review video, it's beautiful, it's soft. Um, I will cut it a little bit of slack because I was moving and it did get a little bit, you know, bumped around in the boxes. Um, but I think it's beautiful. I think that it's soft. It feels nice, it lays very, very nicely. Um, and I think if you just take care of it, what I'm probably gonna do later is condition it. Uh, I think it'll just be even softer and, and good. Um, but anyway, I'm debating, should I even wear a hat? Cause this is cute. Anyway, all right you guys, I have got to go. If you enjoyed this video, please click like, comment, or subscribe, click comment like comment or subscribe and hit the notification bell for some more stuff in the future 
Bye, guys. God bless y'all. Love y'all.